The clips you're going to see today don't belong to me. They belong to Toho from Japan. They make great Godzilla films. I love them. I hope they make more. Enjoy the video. Yeah, I'm going to train myself to be the best ninja. Was I supposed to do something today? The review! <laughs> Hi everyone, I'm Daniel Green. And today, um, I'm gonna continue part two of Godzilla vs. Mechagodzilla before I start leaving. It's very night and I need to go. So, let's finish this off. Where we last ended, two guys have come for the scientists to take to the military base to make Mechagodzilla. They take him there into a bunch of room with other scientists. But the scientists do not know why they're there, so they showed this. <gasps> it's the 9054 Godzilla! But the question is, why did they show him? Hold on. You want to clone it? Not quite. We want to make something like Godzilla. It's called a bio-robot. You're familiar with those, I hear. Yes, you heard that right, people. They are going to use the original bone from the Godzilla that got destroyed in 1954 with the oxygen destroyer to make Mecha Godzilla. In other words, they're going to use the bones. They're going to combine metal with bones. Make it. Robot. Done. Why? Of course, people knew about the Godzilla program, and they're asking questions if she's going to use it on, well, the country or take over the world and such, you know. But she has this to say. No, it most certainly is not. I've contacted world leaders. I've explained to them the threat that we're facing. Wait, what? Oh, um, okay. For a minute, I thought I had to, uh... Let's continue the review. Oh, remember that scientist they needed to make the Godzilla program? Well, he actually had a daughter, so he declined. And he's literally the only one in her life. Yeah. To be honest, if we ever had kids, we would have done the same. Right? Let's eat. I'm hungry. Thanks, Daddy. But the daughter had this to say. Baseball stars. We'll do it like they do. You know... The player keeps his kid in the dugout with him. They do it all the time. Kid, no way they're going to let you be in a military place. A place that they're going to make Mecha Godzilla. A place that might have a lot of guns, explosions, and a lot of stuff. No way they're going to let you do th New proposal. What if we let you take your daughter to work with you? You know, like those baseball players. Might that be something would help change your mind? Are you guys serious? Don't give me that look. Well, kids are kids. Of course, she's going to show off her friends. Just watch. This is where I live. Bye, guys. I'm home. Welcome home. Oh, show off. And we see this really quick, sad scene. Why not, Mom? I wish they'd bring her back to life instead. Okay, I'm feeling bad for this kid. Let's continue the video. So we see military Aki practicing to be in the um, Godzilla, Mecha Godzilla program. Of course she succeeds, but this happens. What the hell are you doing here? You know what? My brother died because of your mistake. Yeah, if you remember about the part one review, Military Aki accidentally killed his brother while they were fighting Godzilla. Mm. They're not getting back from that one. Okay, enough with that scene. A couple scenes later, we finally get to see Mechagodzilla in all his glory. Without knowing, the detector has warned the Japans that Godzilla is coming. What the heck? 
is that? A whale? No, too big. This is AMF H. But before we get to the fight of Godzilla versus Mecha Godzilla, they first decided to tell us about a mechanism and what they have inside the robot that could defeat Godzilla. And it's insanely powerful! I am so glad that Japan never used that on us. We will, we, we will all be dead. Let's continue. After we see that amazing power up, they have detected Godzilla is coming to Tokyo and they got ready for action. Of course, Mecha Godzilla has come into the action. And the best character in the whole movie showed up. Oh, you think I'm talking about the characters? You mean the humans? No, I am talking about Godzilla! We just signed a Godzilla! 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 But the fight we've all been waiting for has arrived! Mecha Godzilla! Yes, the battle we've been waiting for, let's do this! Of course, Mega Godzilla starts off with missiles, but of course it doesn't harm Godzilla. Wait. Now this time they use a nuclear blast laser thing, I don't know what it is, to take him down! Godzilla decided he can't take no more and decided to retreat. But after what this happens. Yeah, remember how I said earlier that they're using the bones of the original Godzilla? Yeah, it's about to bite him in the butt right now. All the backups and systems are not working. Nothing is in control. They're no longer in control of Mecha Godzilla. And Godzilla had this chance and he escaped. When he escaped, Mecha Godzilla did this. You are seeing this right, folks. The original Godzilla from the bones are taking control of the mech. And he started destroying things instantly. Watch. Yeah, it gets real. But it's okay, they say to wait until his battery runs out, but that took like almost the whole day. Wow, they have to be using really good batteries. But that will be all, guys. I'm going to go to my trip. And the minute you watch this, I might be on my trip already. So, I'm Dino Green. And another thing before I go. I might do the other half of this over there. So, I hope all of you enjoy the video. I'm Dino Green. Shining out. And I'm on vacation. Ciao. <laughs> Cut.